Eric Kiemka. Eric Kiemka was a member of the SS in Nazi Germany, who served as Adolf Hitler's primary chauffeur from 1936 to 1945. He was Parisian in the area of the Reich Chancellery and the 30th of April 1945, when Hitler shot himself in the Führer bunker. Kiemka was born in 1910 in Oberhausen to a coal miner with 10 children. Kiemka joined the Nazi party on the 1st of April 1930. Kiemka served as chauffeur for Joseph Terboen until 29th of February 1932 when he was tasked as a reserve driver for Adolf Hitler's personal entourage. He became one of the original members of an eight-man squad, known as the SS Escort Command of the Führer. The unit was assigned with protecting the life of Hitler. In 1936, with the death of Julius Escherich, Kiemka became Hitler's primary chauffeur. He was also appointed by Hitler as chief of Führer's and Reich Chancellor's fleet of cars. As his chauffeur, Kiemka usually drove one of the Hitler's black Mercedes cars from a fleet of six to eight that were stationed in Berlin and other places. Unless in the company of an important person, Hitler would sit in the front, next to Kiemka, with a valley behind him. When traveling in motorcades, Hitler's car would be followed by two cars to the left and right, one with Führer Escort Command men, and the other with a detachment of Reich Security Service men. Further behind would be a car with his adjutants and physicians, and more cars for press agency representatives, stenographers, and provisions. Later in July 1938, upon Kemka's directive, a fully armored laden Mercedes built and delivered in time for Hitler's 50th birthday. The car had 18mm steel plate and 40mm bulletproof glass. Kemka was awarded the SS Honor Sword from Heinrich Himmler. At one time, Kemka had been engaged to Gerda Daranowski, a private secretary of Hitler's. In 1945, as the end of the Nazi Germany drew near, Kiemke accompanied Hitler to the Reich Chancellery and later the Führer bunker. By then, Kiemke oversaw a fleet of 40 vehicles, 60 drivers and mechanics. Kiemke was one of those responsible for the burning of Hitler and Eva Braun's corpses after they committed suicide together on the afternoon of 30th of April 1945. Auda Gaunshi had telephoned Kemka and told him to obtain as much as petrol and bring it to the emergency exit of the Führer bunker. Kemka and his men brought over 8 to 10 army petrol cans, which contained an about 200 liters, and deposited them where they had been told to do so. The lifeless bodies of Hitler and Eva Braun were carried up the stairs and through the bunker's emergency exit to the garden behind the Reich Chancellery, where they were burned. Kemka left the bunker complex on the following night of 1st of May along with the SS Heinrich Duz, a driver who was part of his staff. On the 20th of June, Kemka was captured by U.S. troops at Berchtesgaden and held until the 9th of October 1947. He was the first witness the Americans captured who could confirm the death of Hitler. He was released from captivity on the 9th of October 1947. Kemka died on 24 of January 1975 at the age of 64. Many thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel and like and share this video.